This is a demo I gave on the keynote stage of the past summit, and I wanted to share it with all of you. It's about how you can use Azure OpenAI to create true semantic search experiences directly in Azure Database for Postgres. In this demo, I'm a developer whose job it is to improve the relevance of search results on a recipe website. First, let's walk through how things work before. All right, let's go. You can see my recipes table on the left and it has three columns, title, ingredients, and directions. And if I run a select query with a light clause, and I'm gonna go ahead and highlight that query for you, and I search for recipes with avocado in the title, the results will show on the bottom and I get five results, which is okay. But I could also run this second query and I can search for avocado or in the title or ingredients. And on the bottom, you see the results are better. I get 24 recipes that match. But what if my users really want high protein recipes? Well, when I search for high protein with the light clause in the bottom, you can see I get zero results. But hey, Postgres is good at full text search, so let's try that. First, I need to alter the table to add a new column. I'm gonna call it something wild like text search. And um, after the text search column is added, then I'm gonna be able to run a full text search query and look for avocado, and let's see what happens. I'm gonna get how many results? 25. But what if I run a full text search query and look for high protein recipes, which is what my users really want? When I do that, it's no good. I get zero results. So pattern matching and full text search don't give me semantic search. We're gonna need something else. So let's go ahead and apply Azure OpenAI to the problem and use the new Azure AI extension. I've already installed the Azure AI and PG Vector extensions, and the output of this query that I'm highlighting will show you on the bottom that they are both installed. Azure AI integrates Azure Database for Postgres with Azure OpenAI, and also Azure AI works with and is complementary to the open source PG Vector extension that enables you to store embeddings in Postgres. Now let's go ahead and add a new vector column called Recipe Embedding. It's a computed column and it will automatically generate an embedding using Azure AI. And every time I insert a row, the embedding will be stored in this new column. So before we run any queries, I wanna create an index. And so to do that, I'm gonna go ahead and use create index on the recipes table using HNSW, which is an index type specific to vectors. And once that's done, I can insert a new recipe for oatmeal breakfast bars. And when I query for oatmeal breakfast bars, you can see at the bottom in just a sec, I'll put a red box on it, um, that there's a vector embedding. So let's search for high protein recipes again. I can run a select query using Azure AI. And as you see at the bottom, the search results are dramatically better. So let's step back and look at the query I just ran. Um, Azure AI generated an embedding for high protein recipes and compared it to recipe embeddings that were already stored in the table. As you can see at the bottom, there are oatmeal breakfast bars, even though it doesn't have the term high protein anywhere in it. Before, when I searched for high protein recipes with the light clause and full text search, I got zero rows. And now the top 10 results are all relevant high protein recipes. Okay. We just saw the new Azure AI extension create embeddings. In addition, Azure AI also allows interaction with Azure AI language service to do things like sentiment analysis. So let's do that on some recipe reviews. In this query, I will invoke the Azure AI language service and pass it the review text and see what people are saying about oatmeal breakfast bars. And at the bottom, when you see the query results, and I will put a red box around them, um, the first one's positive, the second negative, the third neutral. But this isn't all you can do. Another thing that's possible with Postgres and Azure AI language is to detect what language something is. So let's run this highlighted select query to see what the language is. And hey, look, the results are at the bottom. It's in Portuguese, incrível. Okay, so the third thing I wanna show you is this feature for PII redaction. Imagine if my users submit personal data. 
I can use Azure AI and run this query that I'm highlighting and call recognize PII entities function. And you can see the output at the bottom. It redacted my teammate Denzel's company name and email address, which is perfect. It's an amazing solution for the redaction of PII. So the new Azure AI extension of Postgres in combination with PG Vector provides these simple integrations to Azure OpenAI and Azure AI language. And it gives you amazing features to empower developers to build entirely new classes of applications. Thank you. Hope you liked it.